a dead man of God. You cannot do this. Listen, listen, you cannot do this. This is wrong. There's no way we can stay without the king. What do you mean? This is wrong. What is this? Wait, I read. One. How can we stay without the king? What is this? What is all this? Look, I'm a man of God. What is this? What is all this? What is all this? What is all this? What is all this? Stop women set up. Sit down. Oh my god. God, no. What is this? What's this? What's this? What is this? We have a king. We have a king. Igwe. We have a king. Igwe. Igwe. We have a king. Igwe. We have a king. Father, please tell me your plans. What plans are you talking about, Father? Don't tell me you do not know that you are the heir apparent for the throne of the Oh, Father, of course I know. But that is not enough for us to start discussing the crown. <laughs> Moreover, you're still very strong and healthy. That said, whenever you are discussing life, you must. Remember it, because he has no enemy or friends. Father, I understand what you're talking about, but you're not dying anytime soon. So what I'm actually saying is that you need a wife. Ah. And you need to start making babies. Should have said so since. Father, I am working on it. In no distance time, I will unveil my wife to be. There is no time. Whatever you are doing, you have to make it fast. All right, Father. I've heard you, and I'll do that. So, I want to go see a friend. Can I go now? It's okay, but don't stay too long. All right, Father. I won't. Yes, father. Papa, mm -hmm. let me go and see my friend. Hey. Where are you going to dress him up? Eh? Well, what is wrong with my dress? Will you shut up your mouth? Are you blind? Don't you know what is wrong? Can't you see that your dressing is bad? This is what we call indecent dressing. Listen, do you know that your royal property? Royal property? My friend, go inside and dress properly. You must learn how to dress properly and look responsible in this village. There is nothing wrong with me. My friend, I said, go inside and dress. Idiot. Look at her useless dress. I don't know what is wrong with children of nowadays. They don't even listen to their fathers anymore.
are you preparing uh, Prince Zeribe for your father? You know, as our tradition demands, he should present to us whoever is his wife who will be the queen of our land when he becomes the king. Although I just finished discussing with him a few hours ago, hmm. and he told me soon. I'm sure that he was soon unveiled to us, he was soon officially unveiled to us, whom his atro is. Soon. Soon. Does he know that we don't have time? The father is fast approaching. Of course or no. In fact, I sang it into his ears like a song. I know he has it in his mind. But uh, on the other hand, we have to take it easy with him. You and I know that uh, marriage is a game of choice and love. All right, so we have to give him time so that he will make the right choice. In the midst of ocean, only a fool will complain he is thirsty. In this our kingdom, we have an array of beautiful girls, many of them. Some with big backside, some with front asshole. Some are tiny, some are big, some are tall, some are short. The prince should look inward. But never mind, just as you said, we we'll have to give him time to give him time, provided that his time does not encroach on our tradition, standing between our tradition. You are right or no? We have to keep our fingers crossed and pray that the gods guide him to pick the right choice that will not affect our kingdom negatively in future. I won't even allow that. Not while I'm still alive. It will not happen. In fact, henceforth, I will begin to guide him to make sure that he will choose the right person. Thank you, Ono, for your concern. Uh, you don't need to thank me. We have been friends even from childhood. And we shall remain friends forever until death do us part. <laughs> Mama, you went looking for her. Yes, Mama. I was almost close to the stream when I saw her trekking with this keg on her head. Under this scorching sun. Huh? You have done well. You have done well. You are a good man, just like your father, Igor Kala. Thank you, Mama, for the compliments. But please, I need you to do me a favor. What is that, Mama? Mama, please. I do not want you to send her to the stream again under this kind of scorching sun. Mama, I told him that it was my choice to go to the stream, but he insisted on bringing me. I did not send her to go and fetch water. Thank you very much for bringing her back. Hmm? It will not happen again. It better not happen. Mm -hmm. eh? Mama, don't you know she's the upcoming queen of this kingdom? My prince, I am not yet the queen. Hence, I have to do my house chores. Exactly, but in due time you will be. Eh? I'm still working on it. Eh? As I said, <laughs> upcoming. Eh? Upcoming queen. I'm doing something at the backyard. Eh? Let me go and continue and finish it. Too. All right. Okay, just go inside. I'll wait for you. But you have to see. No, no, no. Waiting. Ah. Uh, Ma, 
Nazi. How do we go about this unsolved problem that we are having in this our community? What, uh, what, 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 are the problems? what is that you talking about? Are you the one asking? Since the chief priest died, none of his sons has accepted to take over from him. Is that not a problem? You are right. Very big problem. A time bomb, in fact, waiting to explode right in our faces. Oh. Huh. And look at, the Ofala is at hand now. And if we are not able to install a new chief priest, it means that the Ofala will have cover. That's the truth. That's the truth. Someone needs to fill that vacuum. Otherwise, mm, what we are doing is... <laughs> doesn't make sense. Because we all know that if Ofala ritual is not performed, it's as good as that Ofala did not take place. Correct. But wait, are you sure the Igwe is aware of this problem? Are Igwe should now? Huh? Igwe is the custodian of our traditional customs. So he should know. But I still suggest we go and update him on the real facts on them. Yes, because that man has so much on his head. He hope can go. Ojenko, Ojenka, thinking of virtually everything, every time. You are right. Please. You are we right. We need to go and see him. Yeah, we have to go down, remind him of all this. Mm. Mm. You are very correct. I don't know when we can do that. You know, visit him and talk with him. I think we have to think about it. Let it not be today. Uh, yes. Think about it. My princess. Yes, Dad. Please, I want you to look out for your brother. Don't abandon him so that he does not make the wrong choice. You know you are a woman. And you understand the affairs of women more than him. But Dad. Princess Zeribe is no longer a boy. He is old enough to know what's right and wrong. My princess, there is one thing I want you to know. The engine room of a successful home is controlled by the office of the mothers. Who are the mothers? Some good women built their homes. But the bad ones destroy it. If he marries a bad woman, makes the wrong choice, it will destroy his kingdom. But if he makes the right one, through the effort of our team of it will work for him. <laughs> but father, the prince has a lover. Or oh, he hasn't told you about her? No, he hasn't. Uh, is she from this land? Yes. She's from this land. <laughs> but why hasn't he told you about her? Or is he not sure of her yet? Or maybe he's waiting for the right time to do so. Maybe because he told me that he will soon officially unveil who his woman is. <laughs> that brings us to same place. We're saying the same thing. So let's just wait for the appointed time. Umalicha. Yes, Dad. I want to give you this assignment. Okay. Find out who that girl is, who her parents are, and uh, where she is from. I want to know her household, her family. Please do that fast for me. Okay. I'll do just that. So next, I'll get you all the details you need concerning her. Good. I'll be expecting it. It's okay, Father. Don't worry yourself about that. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'll manage um... <laughs> that. Wow. 
This orange is so sweet. You like it? Oh, yeah. I love it. Wow. Hmm? Where did you get it from? I actually got it from Isokwe, from my maternal side. Oh. Yes. Your mother is from Isokwe? Yes, she is. My family is actually a very popular family. Once you get to Isokwe, tell any bike man that you're going to Badinucho's compound and they will take you directly to my compound. Wow. That means your grandfather is that popular. Very. <laughs> You know, my mother told me that this orange tree was actually a pattern gift from the white men that I used to do business with him. Mm. Very sweet. I did love to have more. I'll go to Isioka and get more for you. Ah, oh, don't worry, no. We'll go together. No, my prince, you don't need to follow me. I'll go get it myself. Mm. And before now, you have to manage this one because this is all I have. Okay, if you say so. Mm. <laughs> Oh, so it's your ma. My friend. When will you accept my proposal? Onyana anakazo, which is wrong. Oh my God! Boom! Onyana kachikikom. They caught him red-handed. But the surprise aspect is that he's not even progressing. He is not. How it's do you progress? progress? How can you progress with that kind of life? It ah. doesn't make sense. On a labor. On a labor. Hi. Iko. Iko. Hi. Iko. Iko. Hey. Hmm. Wow. Hey. 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 Oh. Iko, ah, ah, Iko, come and sit down. Sit down and have come. Are you too tired of drinking? Yeah. When, when, when will you stop drinking? I can never be tired of alcohol. Until those of them producing it. He's tired of producing. Hey, God. Uh -uh. Hey. Sit on your own now, Iko. Anyway, what is Yeah, God. man. Sorry. Iko, there is something very important we want to discuss with you. Thank God you are here. We wanted to come to your house and see you. My house? Yes. What are you people coming to my house to do? Iko, listen. You know our next of father is at hand. We need you to take over from your father so that you can perform your father rituals. You told me if you okay, man. To be a quoi? I can never be a chief priest. And uh, <laughs> and being a chief priest is gameful. Yes, you will get a lot. At least not less than two hundred thousand. <laughs> Will be remitted into your account and not just 200,000. Goats, chicken, a lot of yams. My brother, you will have nothing to lose. There will be more than enough food in your house. Honestly. Iko, because you know, our people will bring their first fruits to the gods. You understand? So naturally, you, as the eye of the gods, we are Exactly. For yourself, food, drinks. Drinks! Hey! You people do not tell me that becoming a chief priest is a lucrative business. My brother, I think so. You will have nothing to lose. Absolutely nothing. Eh? Hey! Hey! Hmm. But I don't, I don't want to be a chief priest. My father died a mysterious death. And up till now, the gods have not avenged the death of my father. See, let me tell you. The gods are always sad. They are always angry. Yeah? See, when my father was alive, he would always say, the gods are angry. The gods are angry. The gods are angry. Every time, up to now, the gods are angry. So how will I not go and join them? somebody, somebody who, who is always angry? And I'm, all, I'm a happy person. You see, this is like a hall. I'm always happy. I, 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 cannot, I cannot be sad. So if you are if you are interested, you watch your tongue. If you are interested, go and go and mind your tongue before you incur the wrath of the gods. I'm out there, I'm up with you. What's wrong with you? Wrath of the gods. 
Yeah, is that the mother of the ghost? That that is mother of alcohol. The mother of alcohol. Alcohol is the is the best throat I've ever seen. My sister is waiting for now. See, see. My, my drink is finished. I, I don't know if you have 200 naira. Just give me, let me buy some drinks for myself. I'm fine. I'm not interested on the ghost. You can go ahead and have the ghost. Yeah? Ah, uh, what are you people silent? You people are even poor and you're talking about the ghost. Uh, I'm, I'm going. <laughs> Is this this one you are recommending to be our chief priest? But what do we do now? What exactly are our options? Hi. What do we do? I think we have to wait until we see the Igwe. Yes. We have to wait until we see him. Hi. I'm a guy, Wow. Father. Yes. I need your help. I've been married for the past 15 years now without any issue to show for it. Mm. I seriously need you to help me. What's your name, sister? My name is Mary. Mary? Yes, Father. And your husband? Where is he? My, my husband is fine. Is your husband a devoted Catholic? Oh, Father, to be honest, not anymore. He doesn't come to church anymore. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Jesus. Sister, I see you carrying children. Glory be to Jesus. Glory be to Jesus. Thank you, Father. Yes, children. Beautiful children. So please. I would like to see your husband. Well, Father, my husband has lost faith in God. Yes. He doesn't want to hear anything about Jesus Christ anymore. Anytime. Some preachers come to the house to preach to him, he chased them away. Father, this is going to be a difficult task. Thank you, God. Thank you. Thank you, God. Sister Mary, what I have to tell you is a lot but not for your ears alone. I need you to come with your husband. Yes. A lot, but you must come with your husband. You see, next week, my next counseling day, I would like to see you and your husband, please. Okay, Father, I'll, I'll try my best. Good. Is there a problem? No, no, Father. I think I should stand with me. Listen, there is nothing difficult for God. 
everything is possible in the sight of God. With faith, mountains are moved. You bring your husband here, and I'll counsel both of you. Thank you, Father. May the peace of the Lord be with you. Amen. So, Amen. It is well. Thank you, Father. I'll see you next week. It is well. Oh, no. Thank you for the call, Abbot. You're welcome. Oh, no. I want you to do me a favor. What favor? This I want to ask from you. And I know it's not going to be easy, but it will be possible in your hands. Nkume, go straight to the point. Stop palambulating. Oh, no, it's about my daughter. What is the problem with your daughter? She does not have any problem. You know, I have a very beautiful daughter. Mkume, hmm? go straight to the point. Oh, no. We understand you. <clears throat> I want you to tell the king about my daughter. What has the king got to do with your daughter? Oh, no, you and I know that Zerbe, the second son, who is the heir apparent, to the throne needs a wife. A very beautiful and trained girl like my own daughter. Ukume, you came late. <laughs> oh, yes. The prince in question has mm. a very beautiful girl he has proposed to. Oh, no. How did this happen? How? How oh. come that we have never heard about it? Oh, well, um, <clears throat> the whole thing is still in secret. Even the identity of the girl is still shrouded in mystery. Ah, <laughs> right. But the opportunity is still there. He has not paid her bright price. And uh, there is hope for my daughter. Just tell the king about my daughter. Simple. Adam, let me see what I can do. Please do the needful. Fine, but where are you going to? Where are you going to? I'm going to the market. I want to go and get some stuff. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I'll see you guys later. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. I so much hate this girl. Look how she's carrying herself. I hate her too. Have you noticed the way she throws herself at the prince? My own prince. My prince. And when did the prince become yours? He's my prince. Anyway, I don't have time to tell you anything. But wait, come to think of it. You have never told me that you were crushing on the prince. I'm in love with the prince. I love the prince, but this stupid girl is a hindrance to everybody. Don't worry. I know what to do. I trust you now. Uju with the spices. Yes. Uju with the spices. Say that again. Oh, Uju. <laughs> no, no. Yes, my king. Is it true that Prince Zerbi has a fiancé? Oh, yes. There's this girl he mentioned some time ago. Are you saying he hasn't told you anything about her? I don't understand why Zerbi behaves like this. He has not told me anything. I know I am the one that told him that the power of the king is in the keeping of his secrets. But this is beyond him. He has to confide in his father. Igwe, you don't have to worry yourself about that. Every madman has an IQ. 
Onya ara nwa kwenu ruche ya. Eh? Let's keep watching him while the events unfold. No, no, I am becoming impatient by the day. Prince Zeribi is my only surviving son. Point of correction, Igwe. Zeribe is not your only surviving son. What about Father GK? Have you disowned him too? No, I have not. But I've hmm. given him to God. Now, if anything happens to AJK, oh, I mean Father AJK as you call him. He has nothing in our family. We don't have anything in him. He's gone. I no longer regard him as my son, traditionally. Igwe, I disagree with you. He is still our son. Yes. Well, Lolo, that is not why we're here. We're here to discuss Prince Nziribe. The heir to the throne. He has to get a wife and start making babies. You don't have to worry yourself about all that. He will do it in due time. Let's just follow him patiently. Meanwhile, have you taken your lunch? Or are you not hungry yet? Huh? Where are you coming from? I thought I have warned you to stop dressing indecently. And she's even chewing gums. If I went to see a friend, which kind of friend? Male or female? Papa, there is something I want you to understand. I am an adult and I have the right to do whatever I want to do. Dress however I want to dress. Papa, this is more than age. This is how girls dress in the city. Eh? Eh? Naked. Do you realize that? Oh God, why are you trying to ruin my effort? I'm not doing anything. Will you shut up your mouth? Do you know that I'm preparing you for the prince? So if eventually you become the queen of this land, is that how you're going to be dressing half naked? Papa. Papa, when I become the queen, I will change. Eh. Mm -hmm. Charity, they said, begins at home. If you can't change now, there is no way the prince will marry you. Will you get out of my sight? Get out! I don't just know what is wrong with this girl. Greetings, my prince. How are you? I'm fine, sir. You're welcome, my prince. How are you? I'm good. Uh, Where are you coming from, Prince? 
Oh, yeah, um, Father, I went to see a friend. Fiance, right? uh, no, Father, I don't have a fiancé. Son. Father. Do you know that there is nothing big enough that is son? Mm. The pregnancy is just a character. You can't hide it. Mm. Why are you hiding your affairs? I am your father. You should confide in me. I should be your best confidant. Yes, father. Your highest secret should be in the arsenal of my secrets. Now tell me, who is the girl? Hmm? No. <laughs> uh, father, oh, I am. I am first. Uh, can I use the restroom, father? Okay. Let me go. But to come back to you. Your ma. Ah, Mama. Ah. It's your ma, what is it? What is your problem? Ah? Mama, nothing. I'm fine. You are not fine. It's your ma, you are not fine. Mama, seriously, I am fine. I'm, I'm okay. It's your ma. I am your mother. Hmm? And I am the closest confidant. Whatever the problem is. Eh? And I know, whatever the problem is, don't think about it, just tell me. Together we'll find a solution to it. Trust me, bro. Talk to me. Listen, hey, man, talk to me, don't be scared. Just feel free, feel free. You're my friend, are you not my friend? You're my daughter, are you not my daughter? Go on, tell me, there's no problem. It's, it, it's about the, the prince. What about the prince? He proposed to me. Really? He did? He proposed to you? What did you tell him? What's it, Ago? What are you saying? Who was the meaning of what he did last night? Eh? I don't understand. You don't understand what? I'm not saying I should wait for you. And I was there waiting for you and you refused to show up. It is not my fault. It is not your fault. Which person's fault? Is it my own fault that you refused to show up? I'm sorry, I slept off. Hey, you slept off? Amanda, you and I know that you're lying. Look deep into my eyes, eh? You will know that you are lying. Amanda, this one is a lie. I am not lying. Why will I lie to you? I was sleeping and besides, Cheta was playing games with my phone. Cheta, didn't you tell her that we are supposed to see? Eh? Why, 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 why will I be calling and Cheta did not give you the, your phone? Eh? Eh? I'm sorry, I was sleeping. It's fine. You, you, you know, I love you so much. You, 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 you're supposed to be making me happy. Eh? Anyways, eh, what's your plans now? I don't know. Okay, I think I have a plan. Uh, can we see in the guard quarters? Guard quarters? Yes. Do you want to sack us? Sack? Who will sack us? Is it not when you tell someone that they will know that we are, we, are, we are meeting somewhere? Are you going to tell anybody? Why will you tell your friends? If you see, Amanda, forget all those things. See, they are my friends. And only me know them alone. So don't worry about that one, okay? You just made matters worse. Please, I am not interested. Eh? Amanda, 
You don't need to be doing me like this, so. Because I, I don't understand. How much do you know I love you so much? I go. I go. Please. Amanda. Am Amanda. Amanda, it's only your attention that I need, though. Just your attention. Just your awful attention. Don't worry. I think I know what to do. You see you. Sister Mary, you're welcome. Thank you, Father. But, um... <laughs> where is your husband? I thought I said I wanted to see him. So, where is he, please? Father, my husband refused to come with me. And what seems to be the problem this time? Well, he said he doesn't want to have anything to do with the church. He said he doesn't want to have anything to do with the church. He still maintains that. Yes, <laughs> What actually is the problem? Because there must be a problem. There must be a reason. What happened? If you know this, please share. I really want to know. What happened? According to my husband. Yes. When his late father fell from the palm tree and broke his wrist, none of the church members tried to reach out to him. They didn't pay him a visit, not even a single person. Not even one person? Not even one person. Not even one person from the church? Not even one person? Not even one person, Father. Nobody. Which brings me to my next question. Was his father a Catholic? Yes. He was a devoted Catholic at that. See, Father, he made sure that the priests were well taken care of. He saw to their welfare. But it's quite unfortunate that he didn't get the help he needed when he needed them the most. Before he died, he instructed the children never to go to the church again. And they should not bury him in the Christian way. I'm going to say this is some kind of intrigue of the stories, really. You see, Sister Mary, there is something you... Oh, please excuse me, please. This is a family call, please. <coughs> yes, Father. I hope all is well. Well, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm good. You want to see me? Like I said, I hope all is well. Okay, all right. Okay, I'm having a session now. Not to, not to worry, sir. Not to worry, sir. Okay, all right. I'm very sorry, my father. Very it's okay. sorry. Very sorry. Okay. So, um, Sister Mary, um, moving on, I. Uh, I feel your husband needs to be talked to, okay? Uh, I, I need to talk to your husband. I hope you don't mind if I have his number. Sure, why not? Thank you, thank you, thank you. So please. Sorry, you just called me a gold digger. Yes. Why would you call me that? Do you even know what that means? <laughs> you are not only a gold digger, but an opportunist. You think I don't know what you're doing? Maybe I do not know what I am doing. Tell me, what is it that I am doing? I'm not here to exchange words with you. But I know you charmed the prince. That's why he's even coming close to you, let alone loving you. Oh, it's about the prince. Yes. You are mad. As a matter of fact, you are retarded. You're crazy. 
Let me tell you something. So if they call you right now in front of the king to defend this allegation, will you be able to defend it? Oh yes, I will. The stomach is not afraid to be in front. So if they take me anywhere, I'll be able to prove my claims. Look, listen to me and listen to me carefully. Stay away from the prince because he has been taken. So beware. Excuse me. I don't blame you. It is not your fault. I blame myself for listening to your stupid talk. Just take your girls that I'm in a good mood today. Oh. And I'm in a good mood. Look at her. Mbaji. Good afternoon, Father. Good afternoon, Mother. Please, sit down, sir. All right. Thank you, Father. So you were supposed to get back to me yesterday. What happened? Oh, apologies, Dad. It escaped me. It's fine. Your mother and I have concluded that uh, you need to bring your fiancé home. We want to see her. Mm. Oh, you see, Father, please, Father, I... Don't even go there, son. Yes. For how long are you going to hide your affairs with that girl? Don't you know that you, you are supposed to have settled down by now and start making babies? Huh? You see? You see, son, if you start making babies then. You will grow with them. Yes. And by the time you are getting old in life, getting weak, your children will be made already. So when are you bringing her home? You have to tell us. So that we can prepare because uh, we want to host her in a special way. All right, Father. I'll... I will reach out to her. Whatever she says, I will, I will let you know. Yes, you have to update us so that we can prepare. Get us ready to host her. Yes. Okay. <coughs> um, I have to go see a friend now, Dad. A friend? Yes. You just have to be careful. Go on. I'll take care of myself. Where is your Oh, God, Papa. What is your schedule tomorrow? Tomorrow? Yes. Okay, Papa, I'll be going to see a friend tomorrow. But Papa, why do you ask? Oh, God, Papa. We are going to see the king. Um, I want to introduce you to the royal house. Papa? Yes. Are you serious? Of course I'm serious. Hey! Papa. So tomorrow, I'll be sitting and dining with the royal family. Hey, Papa, for saying this to me, you are the best father. Mm. You are the best father. Hey. Um, Ogade. Papa. Prepare yourself very well. You are meeting the king of this community one on one. Oh, Papa, am I not seeing the prince too? You will see the prince. But the prime target is the king. Yes. If we can secure the interests of the king, the prince is nothing. Oh, Papa, for presenting me with this great opportunity, Papa, you are the best father. Mm. Papa, hi, Papa, I'm honored. Mm. But thank you so much. Thank you. Papa, well, I'm the happiest person. Yes. Hi. Of course, um, my daughter, Papa. I. 
I mean the best for you. All I want is the best for you. Just behave yourself. Not this chewing gum and... Papa, it's mm. okay. Papa, I'll make you proud. Mm. Papa, all those things, I'll not do it again. Okay. But I've changed now. Yeah. All those things, I'll not do it again. I must make you proud. Okay. okay. Papa, let me show you a step. This is how I'll walk into the palace tomorrow. I'll walk into my business. Fasimi. Yeah. So Fasimi. Very, very. This is cat walking or elephant walking. <laughs> Papa, it's called cat walking. It's elephant walking. <laughs> Papa, it's not cat walking. Okay. Cat walking. Happy elephant walking. I don't know which one. Marie is in there. Is in there. Marie is in there. Hold it there. My husband, good day. May thunder strike that your mouth. May thunder fire that your mouth into two pieces. My husband, what, what have I done again? What have I done this time? Where are you coming from? Where are you coming from? I, 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 I went to the parish. I thought I told you before leaving. If you ask me that question one more time, what I would do to you, you would not like it. What did I tell you about the church? What is my take about the church? My, my husband, please, can you calm down? Why have you refused to go and see the Reverend Father? Eh? Why have you refused to go and see him now? See, the Bible made us to understand that all things are passed away. Behold, all things are made new. Why not just forget about the past and embrace the bliss? You keep quiet. Shut those things you call him out. So that was what they told you to come and tell me. That's the nonsense they infused in you. That's the nonsense they infused on you to come and tell me. Oh, yeah. Halele, back to the church. Go back to that church and never come back to my house again until I say so. My husband, I, you must be joking, I know. Uh, why, why are you taking I'm little joking. issues so personal? I am joking. Wait, I am coming. <sighs> my husband, you, you, you're taking. Why are you taking. Let me see you here. Let me see you in this house again. Telling me that I'm joking. It's yours. What? What? Are you serious? Are you serious? Sister Mary, Sister Mary, please, please calm down. Please, 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 please. I mean, I, mean, I, I can't stand tears, please. What? <laughs> Wait, apart from the problems your husband says he has with the church, are you sure there's no other problem somewhere? Are you sure there's nothing in some other place, in some other quarters? Father, this is the main reason that I'm this confused. My husband has never behaved this way before. For him to chase you away from your house with a machete? Really? <laughs> from your house? And he said I shouldn't even come back to the house anymore. I should remain in the party. He said that? Yes, father. Your husband said that? No, this is not <laughs> This is not normal. No, this is not normal. Why would the right-thinking man chase his own wife away from his house? From her house, her matrimonial home? With a machete? For what reason? For what reason? But I need you to help me. Please help me. I, 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 don't, I don't know who to run to. I don't even have any other place to go to. But please help me. It's okay. Please stand up. Stand up. Stand up. No, no, no. Not like, not like you were seen in some wrong place or with some wrong person. It's, you know what? <coughs> we need to see you. Oh, no, Father. Please, let's not go. Father, what? please. No, we need to see him. I need to talk to him. And I don't want him to hurt you. Hurts me. Your husband cannot hurt me. <laughs> it is impossible for him to hurt me. At the face of adversity, God is glorified. Psalm 34, 18. For the Lord is near to the brokenhearted 
and saves those crushed in spirit. Let's also go see your husband. Let's go see your husband. Let's go. Guess what I did to that idiot? Which idiot? It's your man now. Why are you talking as if you don't know what's on board? How am I supposed to know that it's your man is the idiot you're talking about? You have to be very smart. Anytime I say idiot, you should know it's someone I'm talking about. My apologies. Can we proceed? What happened? What did you do to her? <laughs> I gave her the shocking of her life. I gave her serious warning. Serious warning? Yes. Why? Urena. <laughs> Why are you talking as if you don't know that she has been trying to take away my man from me? The prince. Oh, the prince. I forgot. I am sorry about that. <clears throat> I gave her a serious warning. I want her to stay away from the prince. And the next time I see her there, I will deal with her. Uju, why are you wasting your precious time in going to warn that girl? Maybe the prince is just trying to while away time with her. Nothing serious. Remember, she's a very dirty girl. <laughs> I don't see it that way. I don't. Remember, the Ofala is very close. And the prince would choose his queen to be. And I'm just scared he might choose her. The prince is an exposed person. Remember, he schooled abroad. So I believe he will never bring himself so low in getting married to a nobody. No, he won't. <sighs> Rena. Do you think I'm qualified for the prince? Uju, you are a very beautiful girl. You are qualified to be married to anybody. Anybody. <coughs> no, no. Don't say anybody. I cannot get married to a poor man. I cannot. Ah, Uju Mwa. Mm -hmm. Uju with the flavor. Uju with the style. Mm -hmm. Now only rich man go marry your boy. Yes, so please. Okay, I no cannot problem. get married to a poor man. Mm. But for now, you're qualified to get married to anybody. Hold that nonsense. The prince. Okay, the prince, but anybody. You won't attend my wedding. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Yeah, I must be there. I will hold your dress in fact. So, you might go. He is a seed of covenant. Do not ever touch him. Beware. Eme to kwa no nye tere manwaka. Niwe chukuna bia. Eme to kwa no nye tere manwaka. I come in peace. I do not want your peace. Leave my house at once. You, the church, you all are evil. You hide under the influence of the Bible to do evil. Leave. Your wife has told me everything of how the church run by man in that time mistreated your father. In my authority, I'll say, what a shame. But you must understand, my brother, that was a church run by man, not God. So please, you cannot be at war with your maker. You cannot be at war with God. Let bygones be bygones. Let us move into a blissful future and forget the past. Mary, Mary, take this man out of my house. Now listen to me and listen very clearly. I don't want to see you nor any clergyman in my house. Take this man out or I will behead you. Father, please. Father, please, let's leave. I don't want him to hurt you. Please, Father. The ways of God are not the ways of man. Titus Sozo. Gabriel Ibokwe. Ndubisi Okoli. The Catechist. CMO Chairman. Lady Council Chairman. These men 
died in one day. One day they died. Those were my late father's friends in church. How do you know about them? The ways of God, like I said, are never the ways of man. Those men are paying currently for their misdeeds. Let's leave God to do his own bidding. Forgive your wife. Stay at home. Hello? Homes are, are meant to be stayed in the night. The morning, like afternoon, you go out and look for what your family will eat. Anyway, you are partially correct. But I have been coming to your house several, several times looking for you. Eh? What, are, what are you coming to my house to do? I don't have any, any business with you. Ego. Eh? I want us to discuss. Discuss? What are, what are we discussing? Eh? What are we discussing? Oh, oh no. See, let me tell you something. Oh. I, am, I am not happy with you. Oh. I have grudges, grudges against you. Oh no, oh no. You have grudges with me? Yes. Why? What have I done? If you don't die that day, your, your, your son, your so-called son, Somebody that I can pay school fees for. Splash this water on my body. With that, that is useless car. That casket, he called a car. Oh, oh, so sorry. But I'm not my son. Let me apologize on his behalf. You cannot, you cannot apologize on his behalf. Go and bring your son to Nidan and apologize. I, I'm a big boy. I will do that. Iko is a big boy. Iko, uh, you're a big boy. Iko, Iko is evil, evil spirit. I know. I will, I will evil bring spirit. my son. He will come and kneel down, hands up, and beg you. Eh? Iko is but evil uh, spirit. I want us to discuss. Iko, Iko want to see you, but I want before you go to see him, I want us to discuss. Hello, Iko. The evil spirit do not see anybody, no matter who the person is. Tell Igwe to come to my house and see me. I have a, my father built a house for me. I have a house. Igwe, watch your tongue. Tell him to come to my watch house. Watch your tongue. Are you so stupid? Igwe should come and see you. I don't know. Watch your tongue too. You are talking to the worldwide Igwe, the evil spirit. Hi. Be careful. I wonder how the gods will cope with this one. No, where are you going to? I hope your wife knows where you are going to. Well, let me go home. She's a good woman, a devoted Catholic. This woman loves you so much. So please, my brother, do the right thing. Take your wife back, please. Thank you, Father. Thank you so very much for coming. I am very sorry. I. 
I know I've not been a good husband. I just hope you find a place in your heart to forgive me. And I promise I, I will not chase you with a cutlass anymore. Please, my, my love, I am sorry. I promise you that God will never fail us. He has never disappointed. He won't change in our own case. All I need you to do is believe strongly in him. Hold on to him like he's your last hope. And watch and see what he's going to do for us. And I've forgiven you even before you asked. Thank you. Thank you. It's okay. I promise. I'll go to church with you. Let's give God a try. Thank you, Father. Thank you. So, uh, Sister Mary, um, congratulations. Uh, you have to bring your husband to the parish on Tuesday. Then I'll tell you what I need to tell both of you after the confession. Okay, Father. Father, please, I want to use this opportunity to say thank you for restoring um, the long-lost peace to my family. Yes. May the good Lord bless you. And also strengthen you as you keep working in his vineyard. Thank you so much, Father. Thank you so very much. Um, I, I don't know. Father, I'm ashamed of myself. Father, can you God forgive me? You see, I have done terrible things to Christians, uh, especially, especially to preachers like you. I was actually acting on what my late father told us. But I am sorry, Father. I need God's forgiveness. Of course God can forgive you. He's a never forgiving God. Yes. You see, Jesus didn't come for the righteous. He actually came for the sinners. Jesus is the real truth. It isn't the Bible. Only through Jesus can you see the Father. So definitely. God can forgive you only if you're willing to do a little sin. Yes, Father. Are you willing to do a little sin? I am willing. With all your heart? With all my heart, Father. Then let's pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Isioma? Isioma? Mama? Come. Mama, I'm coming. Isioma? Mama? Sit down, sit down, sit down. There's something I want to ask you. Sit down, sit down. Sit. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Isioma? Mama? The prince was here when I went out. Yes, Mama. He, he left five minutes before you returned. Good. Have you not accepted his proposal till now? No, Mama. Why? Mama, were you expecting me to just accept like that? Th that's, that's me being cheap now. You see, Mama? Mama. You see, Adikwa, Mama. Are you okay? What are you waiting for? Mama, see, you have to understand that just because he's a prince doesn't mean that if he proposes to me, I'll just say yes like that. Yeah. Mama, I don't need to be cheap now. I need to package it myself. Mm -hmm. Yes, now. Just because that we are, uh, we are poor mama doesn't mean that I, I don't know my value and my worth. You are very correct. I am my mother's daughter. Mm. He has to calm down. Mm. Yes, mama. I know what yes, I am mama. doing. Yes, mama. Yes, mama. Another five. Take it. Mm. I know what I am doing. Take it again. Take yes. it again. <laughs> mm. I know what I'm doing. But my daughter, you have to be very careful. 
There's this adage we say Sprite goes before a fall. No pride, though. And I'm with him. Please, 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 don't take too much time. Before somebody else come from the other side and come There's nobody else. Yeah, sure. For now, I am blinding him. Yeah! You cannot see I trust person. you. <laughs> I trust hey, Mama, you. Hmm? I don't know. Let me shock him so that you see that I know what I am doing. Okay. So, the prince. You mean that church rat asked me to come and see him instead? Okay. That boy is a nuisance. And he must I think he must be high on something. Can you imagine a human being in his right senses turning down a royal invitation? Insisting that the king must come and see him. Think he's high on something. Well, no, what do you do? We need a chief priest. Or your father will be meaningless. Igwe, the only solution to the problem now is to take away the mantle of chief priest from lawyer for the family. That's all. Uh, but you know that is not possible. Igwe, it, 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 it could be possible. Greetings, Father. Greetings, Honor. Yeah. The Crown Prince. <laughs> no. Thank you, Honor. Oh, Father, there is something I want to discuss with you. Probably when you're done with Honor, you can talk. I hope there's no problem. Oh, Father, all is well. I'll be in my room when you're done with him yourself. It's okay, I'll do those things. All right, fine. Thank you. We have to do something. We just have to come to this. Well, if you insist, eh? no problem. I give you that job. We have to convince him. Even if it means bribing him. Mm -hmm. uh, we need somebody who will be communicating with the gods on our behalf. Uh, no problem. I'll do just that. <laughs> please, uh, I see that you have stopped taking your drink, please. Uh, oh my God, oh my God. If it is, if it is that one, uh, VS will get, I don't know. It has been there for long. Oh no, so no. this one left. That one will get better. <laughs> you are free, you are free. Uh, God! I think I'll go there and check them out by tomorrow. You can handle it. Yes, I know I can handle it. <laughs> hey, Omalisha. Do you know that Nzeribe's girlfriend very well? I mean, who is she? And do you think she is suitable for the prince? Okay, her name is Isioma. She's a beautiful girl. But she's the daughter of a nobody. Yes, I know that her name is Isioma. What I'm asking is, if she is suitable for the prince? For me, I would say no, because she's an undergraduate. And I believe anybody that's going to replace you, the queen of this kingdom, should be a graduate. So my son is dealing with an illiterate. Mom, I didn't say so. I only said she's an undergraduate. We are saying the same thing, you see. Being an undergraduate is madness. We are in a computer age, and whoever that will pilot the leadership of any society, state or country, must be well wired, well educated, so that he or she can contend with other intellectuals in the international level. Hmm? But mom, you know, you can still send her to the university. With which money? I mean, who will bear the expenses of her education? Me or the king? No, it's not possible. It's not possible. There are so many educated maidens in this society. We can pick one for him. Did you say so? Yes, I said so. <laughs> I don't think money is a problem when it comes to the phone. I am saying what
Please, I want you to do me a favor. What favor? I want you to give me your turn to clean the prince's room. In fact, eh, I want to be cleaning his room every day and every time. What do you want with the prince? Good question. You know, eh, I had a dream. And in this dream, I was crowned the queen. Men, women were bound down to my feet. In fact, eh, I was sitting down in the right hand of King Zeri being cut out the two. <laughs> Bravo. <laughs> Excellent dream. Are you sure you're not feverish? Amanda, I'm fine. I'm fine now. Do what I ask you to do, eh? Please, let my ministry. <laughs> okay. You can clean the prince room. But please, be careful so you don't get into trouble. <laughs> it's okay. Thank you very much. I love you. Don't worry, eh? In my ministry, eh? I'll remember you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Are you sure this girl is okay? <laughs> okay. So, Father, have you told your mother and sister? Yes, I already sent the guard to call them. <sighs> May you live long, my king. Yes, okay. Good day, my son. How are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm good. Alright. And you? How are you? All right. Uh, so you can now go ahead to tell us what you want to say as your mother and sister are here. Okay. Um. Thank you, Father, for giving me this opportunity. Oh, uh, my father, my mother, and my beautiful sister, Malicha. Oh, uh, what I'm about to say is what I believe everyone has always waited for. I won't really say much. Oh. I just want to inform the family that I have found my missing rape. Yes. I'm ready to bring the woman I want to spend the rest of my life with so my family can meet her. This is great news. Oh. Thank you, Father. Well, did you hear that? This is the kind of news I always want to hear. Yes. Thank you, Father. Oh, so when is she coming? Oh, by noon tomorrow. Uh, Lord, please, you have to inform the maidens and all the stewards in the palace to prepare because we have to give her a very warm welcome. Thank you, Father. Tomorrow must be a very special day. Thank you, Father. I will do just that. Good. All right. Uh, Father, I want to rush to the markets to get something. Why? Why am I paying the servants in the house? Send them and I get it for you. Oh, I'm Father. Well, at the same time, it's private. I need to go get it myself. Mm. Yeah. If you say so, but uh, you have to take care of yourself. I will, Father. And don't forget that tomorrow is a special day. <laughs> Thank you very much, Father. Thank you. May I take my leave? Father, come on. Excuse me. My king, why are you so serious about bringing in a girl you don't even know? Huh? A day begins a story. Tomorrow, we all will know who she is. My king, I want to tell you something. Excuse me. What kind of a question is that? Is your mom, of course? No. You can't bring that girl to the house. She's a nobody. She's not your class. She's not your standard. Can't you get it through? Whatever you had with that girl, I thought it should have ended on the street. She's not up to the level you're going to bring to the house. Do you want to shame our parents? And Why bring her to the house? I told you you're somebody. 
Yes. Who told you you're somebody? Now listen to me. You and every other girl on the streets we are created the same. But different. You're probably lucky having a royal blood. And that doesn't make you better than any girl on the streets, even the market to women. Now listen to me. I will let you go because you're my sister. And I love you so much. Next time you stop me to say such trash from that your mouth. You will not like what I would do to you. Don't you think we should uh, inform Ejike? About what, my king? About the coming of Prince Nzeribe's fiancé. My king, why are you publicizing this? Publicizing what? Is Ejike no longer part of this family? He is my first son. And the only clergy in this royal household. He needs to see the person that his brother wants to marry. And perhaps he may have his own personal observations on the girl. My king, please. Let's not bother him over nothing. We can take care of the visitor. Besides, AGK is an ordained priest of God. Let's allow him concentrate on the things of God. He is running his heavenly race, crying out loud. You can hear yourself. Don't blame me when I strip him of everything that has to do with this royal house. Do not complain then. Why is your skirt up? What is this now? What do you want? Please be going. The prince will soon go. Which prince? The prince that just drove out? Are you serious? <laughs> Clean the room fast. The queen wants to see us. I don't know what you're up to. God promises this one safe. I was coming to the parish to call you. My son is dying. Your son is dying? Yes, Father. What is wrong with him? Father, I don't know. I don't know, Father. Please, I don't want anything to happen to my son. Help me, please. Please. As water <laughs> reflects the fate of the face, so one's life reflects the heart. <laughs> We walk in faith. We walk in faith. Yes, Father. Glory to Jesus. Hallelujah. Come in. Mm. Why are 
you cry now? I wonder, please just leave me alone. Just leave me alone because you don't know how I'm feeling right now. How are you feeling? Will you stop this madness? Mother, leave me alone now. Leave me alone. I'm in pain right now. Let me just cry out my sorrows. Just leave me alone. You're in pain. Let you cry out your sorrows. You better be careful and stop this madness. Just go away now. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. I blame the priest that is always breaking my heart and I don't blame you. <laughs> Here comes the queen of Kumuku Kingdom. Papa, how does your baby look? Oh God, Papa, are you mad? Who do you want to follow dressing like this? Me? Yes, of course. You. Papa, this is the outfit that will entice the Igwe and capture the prince's attention. Oh God, Papa, did you use the mirror before coming out? Are you saying you don't like my outfit? Papa, check it out now. Papa, check it out. Again, no. Yeah? My friend, go in and change. Don't be stupid. Papa, that means the visit to the palace is no more possible, Lou. What do you mean by that? You look like a prostitute. And I have already told the Igwe that we are coming. Go and change and don't waste my time. Papa, Papa, you know I like dressing like this. And this is one of my best outfits. Oh, God. Papa. I said, go inside and change. Papa, you guys. Stupid girl. But go inside, we're not going home. What is it? Why are you here crying? What can I do for you, my princess? I just asked you a question. Why are you here crying? It's, 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 it's nothing it's not I should be bothered about. I lost my best friend. Get me a glass of fruit juice. My father. Oh Lord, my God. Oh Lord, my King. Your servant besieges you. I beg you, O oh Lord, through the intercession of your archangels, Michael, Gabriel, Raphael, set this boy free. Deliver him, O oh Lord. For he is being enslaved by the enemy. He is being enslaved by evil. Sickness is not the reason you brought him to earth, Lord. For it is said that he who the Son of Man has set free Indeed, 
is free. Son of the Most High God, I set you free today Amen. from the bondage of Satan, from the bondage of evil. Junior, Junior. I speak life into you. Amen. I speak life into you. Amen. I speak life into you. Amen. Glory be to Jesus. Honor to Mary. Glory be to Jesus. Honor to Mary. Glory be to Jesus. Honor to Mary. Wake up. Wake up, my boy. Junior. Wake up. Junior. Hey, Father. He's alive. He's alive, Father. Hey. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. My son is alive. Oh. Would you want to eat? Glory be to God. Are you hungry? Yes. Good. Do you have food for him? Yes, Father, there is food. All right. Please get him food. Okay, Father. Okay. You mean uh, you have a grown-up daughter like this? Yes, Your Majesty. Uh, she's my second daughter. Although my first daughter died three years ago. So she's my first by prosa. Has she been alone? No, Your Majesty, she has been away for so long. She's just coming back from Rwanda. Rwanda. Yes, Your Majesty. My daughter, how is Rwanda? Your Majesty, Rwanda is just there. Oh, you are talking to the Igwe and you are sitting down. You are a woman. You are no more in Rwanda. Hi. Sorry about that, Your Majesty. Sorry, Your Majesty. It's okay, it's fine. Uh, what part of Rwanda did you come from? Kumasi, Your Majesty. Kumasi. Kumasi? I thought Kumasi is in Ghana. Yes, Your Majesty, but that's the Kumasi tribe. And that's by the way, Your Majesty. It's very surprising. Why are you looking for the place? Nothing much, Your Majesty. We just have a lot to talk about. Have you met him before? Your Majesty the Prince. Mazin Kumbe. Let her speak for herself. Sorry. My daughter, go on. Your Majesty, the Prince is a popular person. I've met him a couple of times on the road. We haven't had time to talk with each other. Your Majesty, she's a very nice girl. I try to have one. Yes. I can see. Yeah. <clears throat> it's okay. It's all right. Ah, it's okay. I don't know how to thank no, you, Father. No, no, no. Ah. All glory belongs to God. Right? Yeah. I am just a little God Good. bless you, It Father. is okay. It's Thank you, Father. It's all right, my boy. Huh? Uh, please, like I said, um, bring him to the parish in the evening. I okay? Will, Father. Good, good. You'll come to the parish in the evening, okay? Okay. 
This boy is going to be great. Yes, father. Thank I saw you, father. it. Yes, yes. It's going to be great. And he's going to be very famous too. Yes, father. I'm telling you. Thank you. Father. You know you're going to be great. Yes. You know you're going to be famous. Yes. Good. Now give me five. I have something for you when you come to the parish, yes. okay? Don't fail to bring him this evening. I still have a lot to tell. I will not fail, Father. Okay? I'll bring All right. Him. Thank uh, you very much, okay. Father. Teresa, I want you to advise your husband. Let him take up his responsibility as the chief priest of the kingdom. I don't know what to tell my husband. Iko has refused to be useful to himself. Talk to him more. Work on him. Tell him that his refusal to take up his responsibility eh, is the reason we will not celebrate this year's of Allah. Let him understand it. No, are you serious? Of course I am. Even at that, you don't even know that it is because he could refuse to be the chief priest that is the reason for your childlessness. <laughs> go, you don't go, you don't ask people. Go and ask people. Uh, please, oh, I, I, I don't understand what you mean my husband is the reason for our childlessness. Please explain. Let me tell you. He could refuse to step in the shoes of his father as the chief priest and the gods became angry. Instead of punishing the, 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 the person that caused it, the gods punished you. Hey. Oh yes, they heaped the punishment on you. Oh, are you speaking the truth? Yes, that's why you will not have it. Even in the near future, you will not have until you go and the, the, the gods. Oh no wonder. I'm trying my best. Go and try more, Teresa. Tell him to take up his responsibility. Let him... It's, it's very simple. Answer the call of the gods. That's all. That's all. Then you see how fertile you'll be. Advise him. Oh, no way. I, I, I will try my best. Adma, advise him. Iko will not kill me. So Iko is the reason for her childlessness. What have I gotten myself into? Oh no, thank you! Hey. So, now that I have introduced you to my parents, oh, my family oh. precisely, um, I hope you feel good. And what is next? Um, I should be asking you. Mm. Uh, but I didn't really like the attitude your mother gave me. Oh, my mother. Yep. My mother, my sister, yeah, I know, I know. But at the same time, you of all people should know how mothers behave when it comes to things like this. Even at that, I still feel she doesn't like me. Oh, come on. Does that really matter? It doesn't matter if she likes you or not. All that matters is I like you so much. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. <laughs> Yeah, I want to be with you. Moreover, my father, yeah. 
He likes you so much. And he said to me, yeah, he said, my son, you're a true son of your father. You have good eyes. <laughs> <laughs> if you say so, fine. Uh -huh. But I think this has a little bit of a Yep, little, little, it, will, it will trigger the thing. I, think. Oh, yes. I brought it from school. I got little, little, but at the same time. <laughs> your, oh. your majesty. Mom. Isoma, can I have a word with you alone? Yes, my queen, you can. Yeah. Um, upcoming queen. Mm. Hmm? When you're done talking to my mother, meet me inside. Okay? Okay. All right. <sighs> Teresa! Teresa! Have you ever seen a prisoner before? See, if you are interested in love, then go and carry it. Because you are the cause of our problem. Take the phone and liberate us from childlessness. See, let me tell you. I am not interested. Because I don't want to do the same mistake my father did. Iko, do you know the gods are angry with you? And that is why they have turned their back on us. Do the right thing and you will see breakthrough in all you do. The gods have turned their back on me. I don't believe that. Have you ever seen the girls happy before? They are always sad, 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 as if I were here yesterday. See, let me tell you something. If the girls want me to serve them, they should better change their ways. Then I will follow them. Hiko, you are actually going crazy. You are going nuts. Me? Yes. Going nuts. How dare you speak to the gods like that? Do you want to incur the wrath of gods upon yourself? Which not? Which not are you talking about? See, if the girls are interested, then you should look for somebody against the side that I'm not interested. Are you, are you, are you hearing me? See, are you are disturbing me, oh? You must take that offer. You must take that offer as long as I'm alive. I must take your offer. I must take your offer, Abby. Go and get your gun and shoot me. See, tell you, let me tell you something. I will marry a second wife, oh. I will marry a second wife. Oh, my dead body will you bring a second wife to this house? Okay. I must carry my own children. I must be a children for you. My own children are in my pocket. They are in my pocket. You, 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 you must go and take that off. Oh. You must go and take it. I must get I, 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 I must get a child. That's a, that's a I, don't, I don't know if I did a mistake by marrying you. I don't know. You did a mistake by marrying a, a evil spirit? Yeah, you did a business by money, evil spirit. You must take that off all. My children is in my pocket. Now tell me, what did you give to my son? <laughs> With all due respect, my queen, I seriously do not understand the question. Um, okay, um, let me break it down to your understanding because we all know how daft you are. My mom means. What did you give to the prince to eat? I mean, what charm did you use on him? Because ordinarily, the prince will not come for your kind. Can you start talking already? Um, uh, my queen, I... I don't deal with charms. Not to talk more of using it on someone. I, I've never seen it. I, I don't have any business with charms. I know you used charm on my son. Because I know my son very well. He likes educated ladies. I mean... Well exposed ladies, how come he descended so low to come for a thing like you? A secondary school dropout? Huh? You surprised me, Sioma. Start talking. Do you want us to make this whole community unbearable for you? Do you? No. Um. Say the truth. Now listen to me. Listen very carefully. I don't want to see you anywhere close to my son again. Else, you will regret being born into this land. Now smell out of my face. I mean, get out of my sight. Yes. Whatever seed you sow, ooh, that's you. 
Do not hurt an innocent in an ukwa acharanyagio. God is the voice to the voiceless. Abu. <laughs> My prince. Where is she? She's gone. She's gone. Why did you let her cross the girl without my permission? He! He! Sorry, oh! Sorry! Hey! 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 Lola, what is going on? Is your man left angry? My king, forget that thing. You don't have to worry yourself about her. She's not important. Can someone tell me what's going on? My princess, can you talk to me? Just talk to me. Father, we told her the bitter truth. Like Mother rightly said, she's not important. My daughter, please. Come and get your father a glass of wine from here. He needs to cool off first. Okay. Now, both of you should leave my presence. I say, leave my presence now. My king, are you angry? Or... Leave my presence! my queen. Where is my son? Your son? Eh? He ran along with the girl. Oh. He ran along with the girl? Yes, my queen. Okay. Do not allow him drive out of this compound. Did you hear me? Eh, yes, my queen. Did you hear me, Ago? Yes, my queen. Good. Good. I said, open that gate. My prince, I cannot open the gate, though. <coughs> Smile, I'm Amika. I can't. What did you say? I mean, I, I can't open the gate, though. Smile, I'm handicap. So, you see? Hmm? I, I mean, I can't.
is pursuing that one. Do I know? And why is she dressed like that? Huh? I never knew Isioma can be this beautiful. What? Wait, 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 Urena. Are you admiring my enemy? Ah, no, I am not admiring her. I was only appreciating the handwork of makeup, foundation. Ha! Ah. Did you see the kind of dress she's wearing? Ah! Would you? That dress must be very expensive, rich. Ah. I wonder where she got the money from to get that kind of a dress. Maybe the prince bought it for her. Hey, hey don't, don't even say that. Are you trying to make me jealous? Hmm? Don't say that. What do you mean by maybe the prince? I was only guessing. Don't guess. Don't the guess. The fittings in that clothes and the dress, I mean... Urena. It's perfect. Mm -hmm. Do you want to be her friend? Mm -mm. Your, your friend. Your friend. All right, let's go. Mm -hmm. Oh, this way. This way. Oh. What is the problem here? Peru than the para. Peru than the para. Peru than the para. Peru You haven't told me why you're jubilating. It's only a fool that says there's no God. My friend, my grace has disgraced you. <laughs> hey. hey. Who has your grace disgraced? Amanda, are you not in this palace? Do you need to see what just happened? I am, and I witnessed what happened. Mm -hmm. But how does that make you happy? My God is fighting for me. My dream is gradually coming to pass. Do you know the reason why the Queen rejected the girl that the Prince brought? Is because of me. <laughs> because I am the chosen one. <laughs> oh God. Hey. 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 Mm -hmm. Keep dreaming. Mm -hmm. I don't blame you. I know you are envious. You are envious of my success. But you know what? I will not let you spoil my happiness. <laughs> Peru down the para. Peru. I do not want anyone to insult me for that. What is it? Babe, come on, come on, stop it. Yes, I, I understand my, my mother and my sister can, can they don't like you. They, they, can, they can be funny sometimes. But listen, my father loves you so much. He likes you. Moreover, I'm the one getting married to you, so consider me not them. Listen, I am begging you, just go back to your, your palace. I do not want this kingdom to be so uncomfortable for me. And who said Please. so? Don't want issue. How can this kingdom be uncomfortable for you when I'm there? Listen to me, babe. I am ready to sacrifice my life, my last blood to protect you. No one in this kingdom can make this kingdom uncomfortable for you. It's not going to happen. Never. Come on, please. Please, believe me. I love you so much. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Come on. Let's go. Please. I'm going to enter the car, leave me, but I'm not going to go back to that palace. So. All right, fine, fine. Girl is not good enough for our son. That was why I sent her away. If I may ask Lolo, what is wrong with that girl? Everything is wrong with her. Starting from her level of education to her appearance. Did I hear you say appearance? Yes. Is she not beautiful? Beautiful indeed. 
beauty derived from makeover. Well, I don't care how she looks like. All I know is that my son will not marry her. There is nothing wrong with that girl. She is suitable for our son. She is not suitable for our son. Lolo, are you challenging me? I am not challenging you, my king. Please, let us not start. That girl is a commoner. She's not worth fighting for. And I don't want us to make mistakes just because we are eager to get him a wife. That girl is good for our son. And we must support him to marry her. Mm -mm. My words are final. What is wrong? Why is she not picking her calls? Oh, is her battery low? I don't think so because there used to be constant light. Where will she be? Why is she not picking her calls? What has happened to her phone? There's constant light, so there's no reason why that phone should be. The battery should be down by now. No. Something is wrong. Something is wrong somewhere. Something is definitely wrong. You have to take me to that girl's house now. It's your mom's house? Yeah. No. It's not a wise thing to do. Don't you think it's going to make her feel like she's important? I don't care. Take me to her house now. Okay, let me tell Ago to prepare the key. No. Drive me yourself. If you can't, give me the key. No. <laughs> of course I'll drive it. Uh, where's the khaki? Is it Ago? Okay, let's go. Would you? Would you? Please hold on now, wait. Would you? Would you? Would you? Please come on. The angel of my life. Hi, how are you doing? You must be very stupid. See, if you know what is good for you, get out of my way. Calm down. Calm down. Huh? My love, why are you angry? Huh? My love, why? Why are you angry? You're very stupid, as you became. You're, you, you, in fact, you're senseless. Get out of my way. Calm down. Calm down. Huh? Who offended you? Look, tell me I'll go and fight the person. Who offended you? It's your ancestors that offended me. It's your. My love, do you know you are talking to your love? As you became your love. love you're one and you only. There. Love kill you, as you became. You're very stupid. Hey. See, don't even try me. My Get love. out of my way. My love, please, look. I'm going to fight whoever 
I Thank said. You. I'm telling you, my love. I said, okay, don't touch me. Please, my love. Come back. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. What is it? Would you? Who offended don't touch me? Inside. Don't touch me. I must know who offended you. Would you? Hi! You need to see the way the prince kicked me. Kicked me. Oh! He dealt with me as if I was a robot. Ha! That steps you right. Eh? Huh? You guys showing yourself too much in this palace. Uh -uh. What is wrong with you? Biaela, eh? what are you saying? Eh? What's the meaning of that now? I'm telling you what the prince did to me and you're even adding more. Eh? What's your problem? But wait though, what even gave you the right to tell the prince that you want to open the gate for him? Eh? The prince of this kingdom, what came over you? Ha! So, 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 sometimes eh, I wonder if you even have ear. You, you sometimes you used to talk like Tolo Tolo. Eh? Eh, 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 don't even call me Tolo Tolo again. No. Respect yourself. Respect yourself. Eh? See, let me ask you one question. If it was you, the queen gave order, what will you have done? <laughs> and see what that got you, eh? You refuse to open the door for the prince, Abby. You see what it has gotten to you? Look, eh, I'm busy. I just came back from the market and I have some things I'm doing in the kitchen. I don't have your time, oh? You better hurry up, oh. You know I'm on drugs. You better hurry up. So, so, so sometimes, eh, you, the way you people do something in this palace, I wonder if you even understand what is going on, eh? I'm, to, I'm, I'm saying what is my problem. You, you are there saying nonsense. Na query. Ndala. Nonsense. Problem. Where is my son? My queen, your son is not here. Your son should be in the palace with my daughter. Or did you not see them before you came from the palace? What stupid question is that? Mom, it's obvious this old witch over here is lying to you. Why not you go inside and check for yourself? Are you out of your senses? I'm sure Prince Nzeribe is here. How can you ask me to go inside this mess? Do you want my skin to spoil? You go there and bring out my son. Come on, Mama. You, I can't go in there. That place think like hell. You want me to suffocate? Madam, go inside and bring my brother out here. Yes, go there and bring out my son. Your son is not here. And I'm also looking for my daughter if that is the case. Shut up. You are comparing your stupid daughter with my son. Your daughter that doesn't even have a life. Listen, woman. I give you till nightfall to produce my son. Okay? Else, your body will tell you what I will do to you. Now, let me advise you, old woman. Whatever you think the native doctor gave you, that you gave to your daughter to give to my own brother, has failed. Go and tell him that it has failed. It did not work. Yes. I did not give my daughter any chance. Shut your stupid mouth. I will soon have your time. But for now, I don't have your time. Hold on. I'm also looking for my daughter. I hope it is clear. I am looking for my daughter. So we both share that 25 We should come with the gaps. We will share the 24 hours. You can imagine what gets That is clear. You need to even talk to my world. Yes, very good. I'm looking for my daughter. You are looking for your son. You are giving me 24, 24 hours. Both of us will share the 24 hours. You use 12 to look for your son. I use 12 to look for my daughter. Whatever seed you saw that you must reap. Mpuri kurunua. Kimara Yaki Gauro
Why is this boy not back yet? Huh? Why is this phone switched off? What is this nonsense? Hey. I thought today was going to be the happiest day in this palace. Now look at this. My son's phone has never been switched off. Never. What's going on? Well. Let me check again. Maybe you may have switched it on or possibly it's not. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. My late grandfather. Your late grandfather? Yes. He was also head of the masquerade group in your village. Am I right? Yes, father. He's, he's the CEO of my village. Thank you, father. Thank you. He performed a lot of sacrifices. And when I talk about sacrifices, I mean human sacrifices. Yes. Human sacrifices. In fact, the last one he performed was so outrageous that it backfired at him. Led to his sudden death. Yes. So you see, my brother, my sister, a lot of oracles are currently feeding from your family. Lord of Jesus. Father, so what do we do? Glory to Jesus. Honor to, to Mary. Glory to Jesus. Honor, Honor to, to Mary. Mary. Twenty-one days you will fast and pray. And after the twenty-one days of fasting and fervent prayers, I will come to your house and perform the deliverance service. I want members of your family present. Every member of your family present. Okay, Father. Father, do you mean every member of the family? Everybody? Everybody. Do you have a problem with that? No, Father, I don't. Glory to Jesus. Honor, Honor to, to Mary. Mary. Glory to Jesus. Honor, Honor to Mary. Mary. Here's Joseph. Sister Mary. Who is Joseph? Father, he's my ex. I... I left him for my husband. The devil is a liar. The devil is a liar. Where 
is my son, will not you go? I don't know his whereabouts. Ah, my king, you don't have to worry yourself about Nzeribe. He's a full-grown man. He can take good care of himself wherever he is. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? Why can't you support our son? Huh? My king, you are sounding as if I hate my son. Sweetheart, I love my son so much. As a matter of fact, I want the best for him. Mm -mm, no, you don't want the best for him. If you do, you wouldn't have driven that well-mannered lady he brought away. That girl is a mommy. She is beautiful outside and dirty inside. I'm a woman, a mother for that matter. So when I see a good woman, I will know. Okay? I've examined that girl thoroughly. I've even asked around about her and what everyone is saying about her mother and her is that they are evil people. Yes. Mzeribi's phone has been off since he left this palace. Have you noticed that? My king, you don't have to stress yourself so much. You are stressing your nerves. Remember you are old. You don't need all this stress. Nzeribe is good wherever he is. Nothing will happen to him, okay? I want to be left alone. It's okay. I will be in my room. It's not yet around. I don't know. And everyone is worried. Yeah, I'm worried though. I'm, I'm very worried, eh? Why could you have flee with that stupid, that stupid phone? Oh God, I just hate that girl. God, see the prince should better come back home because if anything to happen to that prince, eh, I will just kill myself. Chitachi, you are gradually running mad. I'm only mad for the prince. See, I hope to become the queen of this land and that dream can only come to pass through the prince. Chitachi. You're becoming stupid. The high time you woke up from your slumber, the better for you. The queen rejected a beautiful girl as Isioma. How much more a maid like you? You better don't put yourself in trouble. You know I love you. I beg, see. Destinies are not the same. Ah. But uh, when will the prince come back? You don't want to answer me. You don't want to answer me. No problem now. Where is the prince? Where is the prince? Eh? His line is still switched on. Hey. Where did he have gone with that stupid girl? Hey! Now I know. That so called Isioma is devilish. Yes. She has used charm on my son in Zeribe. In Zeribe that I know doesn't keep late night. He cannot switch off his phone, not even a second. Now his phone has been switched off for hours. I hope this is not what I'm thinking. Which is? I'm thinking he has eloped with her. Because from the look of things, they are no longer in this community. And you can say for yourself that we went to Ichioma's house and he is not there. You are right. You are right. Ichioma. Yes. 
talk to your mother, IJK. I say, talk to your mother. Look, Zeribe is matured enough to know what he wants and how to enjoy himself. Uh huh. Imagine he brought a very beautiful girl to the house to show your mother the girl he wants to marry. But your mother chased her away. And now, Zeribe is nowhere to be found. His phone is switched off. Look, you just have to come to the house in the morning. You have to come to the house in the morning and talk to your mother. Yes. In the morning, I say. Good night. Why are you like this, Okata? Eh? Why are you reporting me to a little boy? And by the way, why are you disturbing an ordained priest of God by this time of the night? I think you are out of your mind. Oh, you have succeeded in chasing our son away. I knew you never liked him before. That's why you never wanted his happiness. I beg your pardon, o -O -O Okata. What is all this? Huh? <laughs> Just pray that he return. If he doesn't return, if the heir to the throne of my forefathers does not return, I, Okata, will win. We behead you and cast your dead body into the evil forest. Your Highness. <laughs> Is it me you are talking to like If. That? If he doesn't return, I repeat. <laughs> Just pray he returns. Otherwise, you will see the forgotten side of me. Aye, okay. You will see it. Long live the king. Okata has spoken. Women are just jealous. This somebody I married when she was nobody. Now that she has become somebody, she does not want another nobody to become somebody. Can you imagine it? Can you imagine it? Well, let him not return. It's your mom. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, please forgive me. I, I didn't know you were a virgin. But I told you. I told you. Yeah, but I, I didn't believe you. You didn't believe me. Why? I, I thought you were trying to discharge me so I, I won't penetrate. Yes, uh, it was when I saw Just keep quiet, please. Sorry. Sorry, uh... <clears throat> I hope. Uh, Just stop, stop this. Ah, sorry now. Hmm? Please, I have to get going. My mother will be waiting. I mean, she'll be dead worried. I've never slept out before. You want, you want to go? Yes, I want to go. If you get them, don't, don't let her know this happened. Though. Hmm? As if she doesn't find out herself. No, no, no. no. Once you get to, once you see your mother, you arrange yourself. So I've not been arranging myself before. You see, please just get up and I want to change. Get up and go. I want to wear my clothes. Come on, change. Go on, let me wear my clothes now. Go now. Go on, I want to wear my clothes now. I want to wear my clothes. Sorry. Zoma, you know you are the only thing I have in this whole wide world. Why? 
Mama, I only went out with the prince, that's all. Um, Mama, I, I, I have to go now. Oh, please, uh, have this for some I, I don't want your money. I don't want your money. Mama, why are you rejecting his money? He just gave you. He said, will you shut up? Shut it up now! Now leave. Mama, please, I, I mean no harm. Just just for snuff. Go away. I do not want your money. <sighs> Alright, up. Do hold it in case Mama um Is your man, don't touch that money. Inside. Is your man inside? have done that. No. You shouldn't have chased that girl away. Nzerupe is an adult. He should marry anybody he deems fit to marry. That is it. I disagree with you, father. I will not have you call him that, Lolo. While I, the father, is still here, call him by his name. But my king, that is his profession. He's an ordained priest of God and should be addressed properly. Besides, charity begins at home. Are you trying to thwart my effort? Mm -hmm. ah, no, 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 no. Please, 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 please. Mother, I am your son. It is okay to call me educated. It's all right. Just call me educated. It's okay, fine. Okay. Educate, so why are you blaming me without hearing my own side of this story? The girl in question is not good for my son. She is so disrespectful. Has she insulted you? My king, why are you taking this too far? So I can't express my feelings anymore in this house? For crying out loud, I am the queen mother of this land and the woman leader of this community. So my opinion should be accepted too. Ejik, talk to your mother. Who do you want our son to marry? The president's daughter? Will the eight roll if he marries the president's daughter? What I'm saying is that we are in a computer age and whoever the prince will marry must be well educated and should study abroad too. Uh, mother, you're wrong. You're absolutely wrong. You see, marriage is not about class or education or enlightenment, no. Marriage is about love and agreement between two people. The Bible says, therefore a man shall leave his father and mother and cleave unto a woman and they shall become one. One. What God has joined together, let no man put asunder. Why are you people making it look as if I'm the bad person here? Eh? I will let him do his wish. But when what I am fighting against starts happening, nobody should call me. Come back here, Lord. Did you see your mother? She just walked out on me. Oh, Father, please, oh, forgive her. Forgive her, please. I asked you to come the other day that we have a talk concerning your father. Why didn't you show?
sleeping under the scorching sun? Um, <laughs> I'm actually waiting for a cab. A cab? Oh. Alright, uh, come in, let me see if I can help you out. Oh, okay. That would be nice. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Yeah, you're welcome. So, what's the name? My name is Doris. Doris. And you are? Yeah, um, my name is Prince Zerive, the crown prince of this kingdom, heir eh, apparent to the throne. Prince Zerive? Yep. Please just sit there. Oh. Okay. Sorry, are you related to Princess Omalicha? <laughs> That's my kid sister. Woo! Don't say! Do you know she's the one, she's the one I've been looking for? Are you serious? She is the one that brought me to this village and I've been out there for a while now. I lost her oh, contact when I traveled back to America and I don't know, I've been trying to locate the palace or her house. I've not been able to get there. Ah, for real? What a coincidence. Alright, let me take you to her. I'm just driving home. Thank goodness. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm lucky I met you. <laughs> So, where did you come from? Where have you been? Tell me a little bit about you. Oh, um, so like I said, mm -hmm. my name is Doris. Okay. So, I've been in America for a while now. Okay. And that was where I met your sister. Oh, America. Yes, we schooled together. <laughs> <laughs> we schooled together. I see. Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's good. So, how is life generally? Great. Great. How great. Great, everything has been oh, awesome. Mama, what is it that I've done to that girl? What have I done to her? Why does she hate me so much? Why? Yes, Emma, trouble is looming. I can smell it. Honestly. But Mama, I thought they said the queen is a very good woman. <laughs> that woman is it. I mean, she is the devil herself. Yes, Emma, the way that woman spoke to me when she came here, Eh? I started wondering if that is the queen of this land people talk about. Mama, what do we do now? Yes, Mama, run. Run to where, Mama? In I don't understand. Run to where now? I said disappear. That relationship, you will quit it. What? Yes. Mama. Are you okay? Trouble is looming and you are mamarine. What are you marrying? It's over. Father. No, seriously. <laughs> do you realize what you're asking me to do? Do you realize that? But you're my first son. Yes, I know I'm your first son. But I also know I'm a son of God. Son of the Most High God. A follower of Christ. I am not in the world anymore. There are certain things I cannot do because I am not in the world. I am married to Christ. Christ only will I follow. There are certain things I cannot do anymore. Why? Because I am no longer in the world. Son, why are you counting yourself out of this family? What I want you to do on that Ophala day is your birthright as my first son. What are we talking about, Father? What are we talking about here? I cannot do these things. I mean, Zeribe is there. I mean, he's there. Let him do whatever it is you know, you people do. Huh? Yes! Are you asking me to give your bet right to your younger brother? God. What are we talking about here, Father? I serve God. I'm a preacher of the word of God. God is my father. My birthright is to serve God. My birthright is to lead souls who are astray to God. To lead those souls to his kingdom. That is my birthright and my obligation in life. 
I see. How are you? Fine. Oh, you're welcome to my kingdom. Thank you. <laughs> you're welcome. Beautiful place. Thank you very much. Huh? Let me take you to the princess. All right. Welcome. Hi. Home sweet home. Hey, GK. Hey, GK. Hey, GK, how many times have I called you? Oh. Good day, Father. Good day, Your Majesty. Good day, Father. How are you, pretty lady? I'm fine, thank you. Oh, Reverend Father, hey, GK. When did you come? Well, I've been here for quite a while. Right. You're welcome. Mzeribi. Who is the lady? Oh, father. Her name is Doris. She's my sister, the princess friend. She just came back from the state and decided to come see the princess. Huh. Oh my goodness. You're welcome, my daughter. Thank you, Your Majesty. Please. Just make yourself comfortable. Thank you, Your Majesty. Thank you. All right, now, let me see this. All right. What time is it? All the princess. All right, father. Good. Good All right. Okay. Like I said, make yourself comfortable. The princess will show you it. Thank you, Your Majesty. Mm. Mama, this is so hard for me. I don't think this is possible. I don't think it will be very hard. Yes, Mama. You have to make it possible. Yes, because I cannot contend with royalty. Mama, this is not about contending with royalty. I can't quit the relationship with the prince just like that. How? Mama, see, the king likes me. And he's in support of me marrying um, his son. I think that's all that matters, right? That's Do I need king. to get the consent of the queen? That's the king. Let me tell you something that you don't know. You see, Mama, my daughter. When a mother of a man does not accept you in a relationship or in a marriage, it is difficult. For how long can you be running Elta Skata to remain in that marriage? Mama, it is it's just so hard. Tell you, you'll be visiting one native doctor to another just to keep your marriage. Okay? Mama, he hasn't gotten to that point. And besides, I can't just leave the prince. I love him and he's the first man that knew me. It's your ma. Hmm. What did you just say? Oh. How did it happen? When did it happen? Yeah! It's your ma. I thought you said you were going to keep it for your husband to be. You just said I it out. Like that. Should I help yourself? Dada! Who am I seeing? Dada! This is true! Yes! Molly Chow, we missed you so much! 
beautiful in royal attire. Oh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> when did you return to Nigeria? A few days ago. Mm -hmm. yes. And you decided to come and see me? Yes. You know, I've missed you so much. I've missed you too. Come here. Hey, dog, dog. Oh, hey. Good to see you again. My darling friend. I've missed you. I've missed you too. Pardon my manners, please. Let me introduce you to my family. Okay. <laughs> Dad. This is my dad, and this is my elder brother, Father IGK. My pleasure. My princess, save your strength. We have been with her for a while, and then your brother has already told us about her. <laughs> She's the same person I've been speaking to you about, the girl that saved me in school. If not for her dad, I would be dead by now. Hmm. My daughter, Majesty. thank you so much for saving my... Daughter, I've been waiting for a very long time to see you face to face and I appreciate you for what you did for my daughter. Thank you so much. You're welcome, sir. <laughs> and I in turn will say thank you so much. My sister has told me every single thing before. And I say may God in his infinite mercies always, always guide you. Thank you. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Your Majesty. <laughs> Thank you for coming to see me. I've missed you so much. I've missed you too. So. <laughs> you look good. <laughs> Dad, you have to excuse us. We have a lot of cashing up to do. <laughs> Let me get my bags. Dog, <laughs> dog! Yes, I'm a little chance to see you. I've missed you. Come, let's get to my Uh, One still love, remember we are still You know, as you my cause. It is, it is all like the prince. Prince Zabi cannot stay for two days without talking to me. It's, it's not proper. Hmm. I hope it's not what I am thinking. <sighs> Maybe he has gone ahead to do his mother's bidding. I shouldn't conclude. Let me call him. Just keep calling him. Mama, I, I, I have to go now. Please, uh, have this for sleep. I, I don't want sleep. your money. I don't want your money. Mama, why are you rejecting his money? He just gave you. He said, Mama, will you shut up? Shut it up now. Now leave. Mama, please. I, I mean no harm. Just, just for snuff. Go away. I do not want your money. <sighs> All right. Uh, do hold it in case Mama... Um... He said, Mama, don't touch that money. Inside. It's on my inside.
they call and talk to whoever it is. I don't mind. No worries, not too important, okay? <clears throat> what if the person is calling for a business deal? I know who is calling. Have it, have it. Don't mind that person. Okay. I know who is calling and I want to pick the call, okay? Will you say so? Yep. To life. Mm hmm Prosperity. To us. To us. <laughs> Mom money. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My children. So tell me, what is your plan after our wedding? Where do you want us to go for vacation? I chose America. Have you been to New York before? I've been to America. And I have gone to a state like uh, Philly, New Jersey, Texas, Atlanta, mm -hmm. uh, California. But I haven't been to New York. Okay. Had, it's always crowded and it's always very cold. And that's why it's the best place for us to have our honeymoon. Oh, cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Have you been to Paris? Paris, France, yeah? No. I've just seen the love garden. Oh. Beautiful. Okay, so do you speak French? Oh, yes, I speak French fluently. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Okay, let me hear you speak. Oh, so what do you want me to say in French? Okay, teach me how to say what's your name in French? Oh, what's your name is a uh, Kaylee Turner. Then you reply me, Joe Mape. Doris. Oh, great. <laughs> <laughs> How did you learn all of that? Oh, when I was in school, I was attending uh, French classes. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. That's great. Thank you. <laughs> that makes me a genius. Oh, yeah? Oh, That's why you're my favorite. Mm, the speck. <laughs> Baby. Yes. Do you need me to pick the call? Oh, no, no, no. Worry. I'll pick this call because of you. Okay. Left for me. I really don't know how to talk to this person. Please. Do. Okay. Hello. What is it? No, no, tell me what is it? It's obvious I don't want to pick your calls. Yes! It's obvious you're daft. Because it's only a daft person that will behave like this. You keep calling, I keep busying your call, you keep calling, I keep up. What is it? Why? Is it not obvious I don't want to talk to you? Come on, come on. Just listen. You're disturbing my life. I don't want to talk to you. Yeah. So please, avoid me. Yes, avoid me. Good. Stop disturbing my peace. As you can see, probably you're not seeing me. At the moment, you're disturbing my peace because I'm having a nice time with someone so dear to me. Oh yeah? All right. Thank you. No sense. Oh, oh, sorry about my foul. <clears throat> so baby, who was that? Oh, it's really somebody that is not that important. We don't have to talk about the person. Okay. Mm -hmm. You say so. Mm -hmm. Oh, so like I was in how many, how many, how many children? Baby! Oh, yeah, now that. <laughs> I know how there's a doctor that will teach you. No, 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 he. Did he just talk to me like that? No, 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 it is not my Zerbe. Maybe somebody else picked up the phone. Customer, the MTN number you have dialed is currently switched off. Please try again later. Switched off? Who's going on? Love, love, shattered my dreams. Broken me into pieces. Love. 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 Love.
I am ready to take the thing by itself. I don't mind what it takes, so I don't even mind. I am ready. I do understand you. What do you mean by that? Wait, imagine. How, how, how can that lady come all the way from America to take what belongs to me? How now? Shatashi, are you not tired of this madness? Eh? Rest for crying out loud. I will not rest. I will not rest and I cannot rest until my dream comes to pass. Hey. Yeah, Jeta, you are beginning to scare me. Are you sure you are seeing normal? Hey. <laughs> if that lady doesn't leave this palace, if she doesn't leave this palace, she will hear from me shortly. You don't know me. Do you realize you're talking about the future queen of this palace? In a few months' time, she'll be crowned queen. Please stop battling with yourself. Biko, 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 just, just, Biko. If you don't want me to cancel my number one enemy, just leave me alone. Biko. Listen, there are some places your eyes will see, but your legs can never reach. See, some things you will desire, you will never get it until you die. Say, I don't need your opinion. I don't even need your opinion. Eh? Just, people shall have me to pass my passport. Okay, my bag. Okay. Suit yourself and uh, leave it like that. Yes. Would you? What is holding the pan wine? Eh? Oh no. Oh, oh no, we'll take it easy. We are not in a haste. Back to our point. I was telling you that the lady the prince wants to marry is an American. How do you mean? You ask me how do I mean? I'm telling you she's an American girl. Eh? Ah. Oh no. Mio, I'm against the prince marrying outside. I mean, that is not our tradition. Mm -hmm. Our queen must be an indigenous of this land. Mm -hmm. You are right. Yeah? I don't support the idea of marrying outside this place. It's not that we don't have beautiful girls in this village. We do have them. Oh no, we have them in mass. As a matter of fact, my daughter is an example. Oh no, tell me, which maiden is more beautiful than my daughter? Uh, anyway, let's not continue to banter over the discussion. Tomorrow we'll table it before the king. We'll be at the palace. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Okay. Hmm. How more of you? Serve yourself. This is a familiar trip. If I put the bunk when I can among a little itty, itty. I will put the bunk when you never sacarin and an anna. But this is it. It's from a from a love, 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 me one lamo be more. Love, love, love has broken my heart. Love, 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 me want la more, more. Love, love, love has broken my heart. I'm gonna get in a Hey, I told you. <laughs> Stop there, my friend. Did I tell you? I told you. Told you. Mm hmm I am begging you. With every single thing you hold dear, please just stay my way. And if I don't, will you swallow me? <laughs> Would you please out of my way? I told you to cut your coat according to your size. You didn't listen. Now, he has left you, right? You didn't want to listen, I told you to leave him for me. You were carrying yourself in the village like a queen already. <laughs> Who is crying now? Oh, on my way. <laughs> I told you to leave him for me. You did not listen. Now you've lost everything. Nonsense. <laughs> Your Highness, we heard that the crown prince of this great land is getting married to a lady that is not from this community. Is that true? 
Yes. Mazim Kume. Do you have any problem with that? Yes. Because that is not our tradition. Kume. You and tradition. Huh? Okay, if I may ask, what is our tradition? Mazin Chief, am I supposed to be teaching you our custom and tradition? We all know that it's against our tradition. The prince is supposed to pick a maiden from this community. That's not going to be possible. Because the prince have already chosen the person to marry. As far as I'm concerned, there is absolutely nothing wrong with the prince marrying from anywhere he likes. The prince can pick any maiden of his choice from any part of Ibu land. Yes. Even beyond. Mm -hmm. This is a modern society. In fact, there are very gray areas of our tradition that need to be... My okay. oh, Hold on, let me finish. There are so many gray areas of our tradition that need to be fine-tuned to suit the current trend of Mas, okay. uh -huh. You are sick in the head. So you are one of those people rubbishing our tradition. It is you who is sick in the head. No, no, no. You are sick! Uh, sick in the head! Mazo Kela and then Kume. Uh -uh. We are not here for this. And uh, don't forget, we are here with our Igwe. Igwe. Uh? Bikoni. It's not a personal issue. Mazin Kume, mm. let me ask you. Ask me. Your late wife, where is she from? Okay, answer him. No, answer him! Am I a prince? I am eligible to marry from anywhere I chose. Does that answer your question? Well, my people, you have all spoken well. Laws are made by man, for man and not man for the law. That law you are talking about have been abolished long time ago. How come I don't know about it? Huh? Only came. He would know anything. <laughs> Mazin Kume. Your Highness. It's enough. I hear about Varu this topic. Anybody that talks about it again shall be sanctioned. Ibe. Okay, now can we not go straight to why we are here? What do you think we are here for? Is to strengthen what is wrong and correct the ills in this village. Go and get me my food. No food for you. Let, let me pretend as if I didn't hear what you said. Tell me, tell me, tell me, baby. Just go inside and get me my food. And I said there was no food for you. Do you realize you're talking to your husband? Husband by foot. So you expect me to go and sell my pants or my brass to cook for you? Or I should kill myself because I got married to you? Look, let me tell you. You did not drop any money in this house before leaving. So there is no food for you. Teresa! Can't you improvise? 
I, I, I can't tell me since the days and years I married you. You know you don't have studies. Why are you closing your nose? Look, let me tell you. You will not enter this house today. You will sleep outside here or you go back to the joint you're coming from. Why am I even wasting my time here? Steady, steady. You want to close the door? I will have, I, I will, I will break this door. I will, I will, I will break this door. Did I say I will break this door? No. I will not break this house. I, I cannot be this kind of house. My father's house. I cannot be this kind of house. No, don't worry. Let me go. Go to my second home. Second wife. Let, let me go and eat. Nonsense. Close the close the door if you like. Let, let me go and eat. Nonsense. Obstructing my way. Is hey. your life not important to you? Huh? Ah, please. Do not go through this way. Do not do that. It's broad. Please, leave her away. I mean, are you mad or something is wrong with you? What, what, what was he talking about? What, what road to death? Who was talking about death here? Huh? Ah, please. Look, hey, 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 listen, I'm still talking. Are you aware you are, you are doing this to the, to the heir apparent to the throne? The prince of this kingdom, listen to me, if you don't leave my way now, I will beat you up. I will throw you out of this road. I know, my prince. I know, my prince. But I'll follow here. If you follow through this way, you will die. Turn back. Follow the other side. If you want to leave. Hey, hey, young man, listen, listen. You're really pissing me off. If you don't leave my way now, I will go into this car and run you over. Mm -hmm. Now, please leave. The short and long life lies in your ear. If you follow my instruction, you will not die. But if you go ahead, you will die. And not say, you go, the evil spirit did not die. What, 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 what was that your name again? He, he got, hey, listen to me. Hey, 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 hey. You are pissing me off. If you don't leave the road now, I will go into this car and I will run you over. I have a very important place to go. My prince, I know you have a better place to go to. But what other important place is better than your life? Anyway, you go. The spirit has spoken. You like follow here? Like you know, I just follow this place to go and bring my apple at You follow here, you die. If you turn back, you will leave. I have spoken. Thank you, thank you for advising me. Now, can you leave the road for me? Please leave her. Can away. you leave the road? Hey, hey, hey. sorry. I'll leave. I will leave. I will leave. So that you can pass. I didn't Sir, I did not tell you. Thank you for the warning. Oh, sir, I did not warn you. Thank you for warning me. The press. The press. Bye bye. Hey, bye bye. What is the meaning of this dream? What was it talking about and who is after me? Could it be Isioma? No, she can't do me anything. But what does it mean by the road to death is broad? Well, it's just a nightmare. After all, I am the crown prince of this kingdom. I am indestructible. Oh, good morning, Father. Good morning, son. How was your night? 
Splendid, Father. Just good. Uh, Father, I have something to tell you. I'm all ears. All right, Father. <clears throat> Father, Doris and I are traveling to Lagos next tomorrow. Traveling to Lagos? Yes, Father. Why? We're going for shopping. Are there no good shops in this state? Why in Lagos? Well, Father, there are better shops in Lagos. Uh, outside that, I just want us to hang out, spend some time together. Uh, moreover, she promised to introduce me to some dignitaries, some personalities. The destiny of this great kingdom is already on your shoulders. You need to be careful and watch your steps. I know, Father. I am always careful. Father, you taught me well while growing up. You inculcated in me very well. I will never let you down. It's okay. You may go. But be careful. Don't ever forget where you are coming from and what you stand for. Like I said, Father, I will never disappoint you. Sorry. How is Doris? Oh, yes, Father, she's fine. She's doing well. So, may I have the permission to take my leave, Father? Okay. Let's go.